and welcome back. I went off screen to head over here just so you don't have to see it. And as you can see, Loire is bigger again. This is lovely, very French and all. Though I think we're not actually supposed to be, you know, in French ish area. I think we're more closer to Spain. I'm not so sure. You don't seem to have a whole lot of customers in here. Uh, that's a reference to the penguin and the girl that we gave flowers to. Your town has advanced again. Why are you still talking about the old stuff? You can see Matisse's painting is on the wall. What do you have to say about this town? Okay. Sure! Yeah, that's basically saying where the star stones are. Which might be good to know, although I already know where they are. And I don't quite have 5,000 gems yet. That is sad. So! Piss off, you asshole. You have anything? The town advances, but the equipment doesn't. That is so against what RPGs usually do. So, Pierre. Hey, that's good to know. This is a masterpiece. That angel, Orion, whatever warrior, is nothing compared to this. You shouldn't have wanted fame, then? Well, I guess technically he didn't want fame, he just wanted people to like his paintings. Oh, I want to know what's 50% off! But I can't read.
uh, hand cam thingy, I guess. Hmm, the view of stone pavement. It's gorgeous, is it not? I think you can buy a house in this game. I think it's in Sun Coast. Or maybe it's this room that we're gonna buy. I'm not sure. I could have sworn I could buy a house eventually. Maybe I'm confusing it with a different game. What? She's dead? You have my condolences. I guess he worked with acid and has burned him bald on the top. You know, in Illusion of Gaia, the protagonist's hair actually blows in the wind. His hair is so nice and soft. Did I hurt your feelings? What a waste for TVs and lights to be on in rooms where nobody is. Yeah, you already got Suncoast's picture and all. Get with the times, lady! Oh, Marilee's got even bigger. Wonderful. Well, the only new one is the nice suit, which is really not worth it. Then again, she's designing clothes and not army. Uh, armor. Not army. So, puppy law? Anoyone! Anoyone, okay. Okay, I've basically spent 10 minutes in this area now checking it out. I should probably proceed. There's someone I haven't talked to yet. What is this? Oh, jeans!
Yeah, sure. Well, since I'm trying to get 5,000 together to save King Bird, then again I'll just save him off screen. Yeah, sure, let's. Let's get an apartment. I am a man's man now. I have my own home. Yeah, the things you can buy really aside from maybe the desk and the bed. It's really only there to, you know, fill the place up. That's all it's there for. So let's quick check it out and then we'll leave. Um, it was this one, right? Yes. Yay! I could have sworn the that I can buy a house, but that it costs like 9,999 gems. But maybe I'm once again confusing it with a different game. Basically, that was Loire, and I'm trying to see if Litz also grew, but I can't see it. And the Tollgate is still here? Uh, Litz didn't grow a whole lot anymore, but whatever. What I wanted to do was head for Nerlaka. Because of reasons. Oh my god! What happened? Oh my god! This is terrible! Well, how'd the fire start? I know. As a player of Rune Factory and Harvest Moon, I know how annoying it is when your crops die or get burnt or otherwise damaged. You know what happened in the previous screen? That didn't happen! Be happy! Wills is still here! That really is weird. Yeah, who cares if other people lost their homes? By the way, yes, Nerlaka gets damaged alongside Neo Tokyo, I guess, although I'm not sure how this happened. Like, there was a fire, okay, what started the fire? I know, which is why I am here. We can rebuild Nalaka. Do I have to talk to you? Yes. At least, I think I do. Yes, of course, it's the right guy.
This is something I never did because, honestly, I never went back to Nelaka, so I never even knew that Nelaka somehow got damaged at this point. So, it's surprising and this is the first time I'm doing this. Honestly, unless I had read, you know, unless I... I never would have known that Nelaka was damaged until I read it in a guide, and I'm like, what? When did that happen? Yeah, let's make kids rebuild a city! Well, village, technically. But yes, we basically have to go and give these letters to practically every person who we helped previously with their stuff. Like Belle, Eddie, Pierre, stuff like that. Why? She's your ex, she dumped you over nothing, and you're still helping her? Why don't you just help out of the goodness of your heart and not because your bitch ex girl lives there? I'm surprised none of you actually saw this fire that apparently rampaged through Nerlaka, and I just had lag. Why did I have lag? Um... Will, Bell, Eddie... I have to give some to Rich, the sardine guy... Those are five... Three or four people in Loire, so that's either eight or nine already, so... Let's head to Rich first, since he's faster and I don't have to go through a harbor screen to get out there. You'd think Rich would get himself a bigger house, but he doesn't. I wonder how he got money. Was he born into a wealthy family? Did he kill people for money? Well, Southern Europe. Hmm, sorry. Southern Europe, I guess this is Spain, France ish, close enough. If we consider it to be very squished together. Um, Tin Sardine Guy was here? Yes. You know, sending work power would be helpful, too. Did I forget Stoma? Was Stoma the guy I had to give it to? Well, it's technically not my restoration fund.
If she was thinking I was trying to confess my love or propose to her... I don't think I would do it via letter. That's the tourism bureau. Uh, Pierre was... Uh, at the bottom. So, I have one last letter, which I do think I have to give it to Stoma. Do I have to give it to Peril? I can't be Peril because he's not in freedom anymore. I guess it's back to freedom then. Oh yeah, I didn't lottery that dude. Eh, let's give it a shot. Okay. One quick on-screen shot, and I failed. Stoma was in this house? Yes. Okay, it wasn't Stoma. Will? Belle? Eddie? Merrily? Wine Dude? Pierre? Who did I give the letters to? I already forgot. The Cannery Guy? I forgot. Let me quick check a guide, because I cannot remember the last person. Of course, I have to give it to Matisse. That proves how forgettable the artist is. Oh man. Well, quick back to Loire. And then we can finish up Nelaka, sort of. Good. That was all nine people, so... Nalaka should be okay now.
either it's rebuilt or it's already slightly advanced, I'm not sure. We'll see. It's bigger. There's a tiny house there. It is wonderful, yes. Illinois? Well, this does sort of... America-ish. Prevents transformations? Something transforms you in this game? Doesn't ring a bell. Sun Coast is the last one that we have to, you know, advance. Which we should be able to do because we now have a tourism bureau here in Nalaka and I have to show them the pictures of Sun Coast and then Sun Coast should work. Oh my god, that's creepy. Okay. Good for you. Why can't I walk behind him? Uh, there's probably a chair behind him. Well, tourism bro. Behold the amazement of Sun Coast. Yeah, things were so much better. I'll make sure to be quiet. Well, Narlaka is better now. And... Okay. 
Where is Will then? Yes, no ish. Maybe I Kavayua Cattle. Okay, that explained everything. I think Amanda just got replaced too. So, where's Will? Does he have a little place over here? Now off to Sun Coast, which I think I can't get to via plane yet. I have to get them the field plans first. As I know, Lyoto is an area that can't be advanced and just shouldn't be advanced. Oh, still itty bitty. I have airfield plans. Why aren't you taking them? Do I have to show them to one of the people debating? I'm guessing so. What do you have to say? Okay, 
Okay, so it should advance if we leave now. Well, not yet, so might as well go over here. Because this is actually part of the plot. I think if you talk to him before you resurrect Beruga and get to this part, he doesn't... Ugh. He doesn't give you anything. You haven't advanced Sun Coast? Okay. Maybe I have to enter a different area then. You know, like... Enter a port or a harbor and then leave. It seemed to have worked for Loire and Litz at times. So let's quick... There's a harbor over here, right? Yes. Or this is the area of China. And I just realized I didn't enter a port. But... Hopefully, whatever. Ah, there we go. Now we could get here via flying. Uh huh. Nothing else. Okay. I'm gonna keep raising my cows with great pride, and then we're gonna kill them for meat. Yay! Dodge Dog Doobie now. Bleeding Dose. Ah, love. And there's the guy with the fever.
Yay! And I think that, aside from King Bird, is the last side quest-ish you have to do. Or can do. You lied to me! You said this was a gift shop, not a maggie shop. Meh. Eh. Strength into luck? Meh. Doesn't seem all that great. I mean, sure, with like. 50, whatever, luck. I would have a ton of critical damage, but... Meh! Ugh. 35 plates? Zoo? What zoo? Also, yes, long episode again. Well, yeah. They cling there because it's safe. I mean, Neo? Sorry about that. Wasn't quite my intention. Of course they move. Anyway, I guess we have now gotten All the towns advanced, and we'll proceed with Star Zones next time!